Leos. What's good with that? What's good with the Leos? So, what we're about to do right now is get into a reading, of course, but this reading is going to be about hidden traits. Now, I don't know if you have these hidden traits, Leo. I don't know if somebody else has them. But the purpose of this reading is to unearth them and find out who got them and what they are. All right? I may cuss, but I don't curse. And um, with that being said, I also want to do a promotion. So, if you need to get in contact with me or you know someone who wants to get in contact with me, you know, book a reading of some sort, they can go to the channel tab and they can click on the link that'll bring you to a website. On that website, you'll be able to book an appointment with me. You can link with me via Google Meet, pause, and if you don't have Google Meet, you can check. If you got Zoom, if you got Zoom, I can get Zoom and I can do a Zoom call with you. If you don't want to see me, you don't want me to see you, fine. We can get on the telephone and have it done that way, all right? Also, I just added ASMR to my link tree. If you're not into that type of stuff and you don't have no type of kink or fetish for the ASMR joint, don't go there. But if you do or you know somebody who does, go check it out. Please put the babies away. It's not for the babies. I'm telling you, put some headphones on. I get wow. Now, I'm going to cut this deck. And we're going to find out some secrets. Bam. Knight of Swords. This person has a plan. This person is plotting on something. Plot is usually associated with something evil sounding, is it? I don't I don't see that necessarily though. So if there's another plan instead of plot, we'll say, all right? Um You don't know what this person is going to do. Now this might be you, Leo. You make it fit how it's supposed to fit. Pause. But I'm getting... You know what I'm picking up on? I'm picking up on... This person has a plan for a lover. Or they're doing something in the name of love. And I think they've been sitting around for too long occupying themselves with something that has taken a bit long and what it has done is it has built up this energy and this this desire to to come to this point pause and really dart out there and go after whatever it, it is that they're going after now I don't know if you're This might, what's going to be shocking about this revelation, and I don't know when it's going to be revealed to you, is that this is out of this person's character. You may have not have known that they had it in them, pause. Or you could detect that this person harbors things, thoughts, more than likely thoughts they keep to themselves. But you may have not known that these thoughts has been festering and festering and festering. And when they strike, this is going to be a decisive strike. Something that they've already contemplated over and over in their head. But this is an opportunity for them. So I'm seeing more of a positive twist to this. I'm seeing this as they had to get low, so to speak, when it comes to communicating and sh even showing love to other people because they realize that the, all that will be doing is wasting the energy that they got for what they got their eyes set on. So if it is a lover, why try to spend time in, in love with y'all or money on y'all when y'all are not what I'm after, y'all are not what I want, I know what I want. 
but I'm not communicating what I want because I know motherfuckers be out here sabotaging shit. So this is probably why you don't know. And this is what you don't know and it's probably why you don't know as well. You may be the critical type. Or Leo, if this is you, you know that other people are the critical type that are around you in your immediate vicinity and you don't trust them like that to be telling them shit like this. But you're going to seize the moment it's like jumping in double dutch. You got to time that bitch. You know what I'm saying? And then when you got it, boom, you win that bitch dancing and that's you. Just, or whoever this person is, they out. You understand? And it's going to, people going to be taken aback by it like, oh, what the fuck? Look at them go. But they're going to get what they want. Whoever this person is. I'm going to draw another card to see how you feel about this, Leo. It might even give some details to see if this is you. But let's see. Queen of Pentacles. Somebody's ovulating. This might be you that they're going after, Leo. If you're ovulating, I'm just saying. Because this, this could happen as soon as I upload the reading. It's how fast this can happen. This can happen within the next two weeks, two months, two days. If you're the type of person, let me tell you this, right? If you know, if, if this is not you, that I'm, the person that I'm describing, Leo, you've helped this person in some type of way. You've offered them something. You've showed them love and affection, probably when no one else would, or it's the type of affection that they've been selective about. Like, oh, yeah, other, other people offer them love and shit like that. And be like, oh, yeah, 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 thanks, thanks, thanks. But when you did it, it was like, oh, shit, that's the one right there. That's the one. Like the way he did it or the way she did it got them on 10. Even makes them better themselves. Makes them, you know, put some pep in their step. And like I said, save up their money and, you know, not showing, not expending on other things other than what they truly want, which is you. If you're this type of person who is caring, nurturing, um has common sense you know what i'm saying no has a stable solid foundation you're solid if you're that type of individual and you show this person some love that's the person that i'm talking about um i'm getting you will even be shocked by this or you yeah you you will be shocked by this You might have even like planted a seed, like in an encouraging type of way. Like, oh yeah, I seen you the other day and you know, I seen your browns ain't match your blues too well. And I seen this joint that go with it, so I picked it up because I felt it matched better. So, here you go. Maybe not in that type of tone, you probably didn't shoot him down first or shoot her down first like oh yeah shit ain't go too well together you know what i mean but you get what i'm saying like you you did something thoughtful and caring out of but out of concern as well like you you encouraged them to be better you know what i'm saying it's kind of like the mother vibe it's the queen of pentacles it's the mother vibe you know what i'm saying and you you were wise and smart enough to know like this is all this person needs like they they're full of potential they put their head down and they don't show you fully. They don't bring it out. And you're just like, yo, I'm going to feed them. They're going to bring it out. But you're not going to expect it. To, you, you, The way you move, you move in a more gradual way. Like gradual growth. You didn't think this motherfucker was going to come busting out like that. Pause. So it's going to even shock you despite you being the catalyst for this to happen. Let's see the factor that we should consider regarding this matter. More pentacles. It's the king of pentacles, but in reverse. Okay. I see what's going on here. 
automatically. Because of this spark, and I don't want you to be mad at yourself. Leo, I'm getting that this person that I'm talking about is not you. But I'm I'm continuing, I'm standing on this. I believe that you're the person that encouraged this person. You sparked the light in them. You, you enhanced their abilities. And when this person comes, pause, they're going to be super excited. Because... They might like I'm not saying that they're gonna move in with you like y'all are gonna move in together but they might like spend a night bring they spend a night bag here and there feel how it is to be homey around you feel how it is to be in home with you and they're going to take that experience as they're not going to take it for what it's worth they're going to look at it like, man, that was great. But now I got to work even harder to get money so I can continue to have this relationship with Leo. They're going to get materialistic on that ass. They'll probably buy you nice things and all kind of shit. Which is not going to be in their best interest. You see, they could have matched your fly. Queen of Pentacles, King of Pentacles. Right? But with the King in reverse, they're going to drop the bag by trying to, not to impress you, but just to keep up with you. To, to be on your level. They feel, they feel like you got a standard and they should meet that standard. And because of that, they're going to preoccupy themselves with getting more money, getting more money, getting more money, instead of just spending the time with you. Remember, this, this is a person who stacked up money, starved other people of attention and love, just to give it to you. So, the attention and love is the major factor the major components when it comes to you this person was a determined person anyway they was going to take action in their career whatever they do for work anyway but that connection that confirmation to be with you is going to be like man i gotta do more now i gotta be on my a game i gotta and they're going to be more focused on the money than they are on you so this is the factor to consider this is someone who will also like They'll break the law to get the money. Now listen closely to what I'm saying. They won't break the law to be with you. They'll break the law to get the money. So take that how you're supposed to take it. Pause. Until next time.